Ever wondered why today's seven foot basketball players are dominating the game like never before? Imagine you're up against a seven footer on the court. Intimidating, right? But these giants of the game are no longer just towering defenders. They're skilled shooters, playmakers, and versatile athletes like never before. Today, we're diving into why modern seven foot players are not only bigger, but also way more skilled than their predecessors. Before we get into it, make sure to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up if you love exploring the evolution of basketball skills. Towering basketball players have long commanded the court with their impressive presence. But today's seven foot players are more skilled, versatile, and dynamic than ever before. So what changed? Why are modern seven footers like Victor Wimbanyama redefining the game in ways that legends like Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, though iconic, didn't back then? The old guard, past seven foot legends. To understand why today's seven footers are different, let's look back at some of the NBA's first giants. Players like Kareem Abdul-Jabbar and Hakeem Olajuwon dominated with unmatched skills for their time. Kareem's iconic skyhook shot was nearly unstoppable, and Hakeem's dream shake became legendary for its finesse. But even with their skill sets, their roles were primarily confined to the paint close to the basket, focusing on defense, rebounds, and short-range shots. Back then, height meant dominance at the rim. Skill sets were focused on post moves, blocking shots, and snagging rebounds. Dribbling and shooting from range? That was mostly left to the guards and smaller players. Modern Giants, Wembenyama, and today's Seven Footers. Today we have Victor Wembenyama, a seven foot four athlete with the agility and skill skills of a guard. Wembenyama's skill set is a whole new level of versatility. He can shoot from beyond the arc, drive to the basket, block shots, and even handle the ball. Unlike past players, Wembenyama and others like Nikola Jokic, Joel Embiid, and Kristaps Porzingis don't just stick to the paint. They can play all over the court, offering their team's offensive and defensive flexibility unheard of in previous eras. Evolution in training and skills development. So what's behind this evolution? One major factor is the shift in training methods. Back in Kareem's era, seven footers weren't encouraged to develop guard-like skills, but today's players are. Advanced training techniques have transformed how players develop. Now, coaches recognize that height shouldn't limit skill potential. From a young age, tall players are taught to dribble, shoot from a distance, and move quickly. This comprehensive skill development allows big players to do things that were once reserved for smaller athletes. Thanks to specialized training programs and individual coaches, today's seven-footers are gaining skills early, developing a range of abilities beyond traditional center play. Impact of technology and data analysis. Technology has also played a huge role. With data Data analytics, players can analyze every move in detail. Technology now allows coaches to break down player weaknesses and strengths more precisely than ever. Motion tracking, video analysis, and wearable tech help big players perfect moves that wouldn't have been accessible in the past. Thanks to this tech, players like Wembenyama can refine their three-point shot or improve their agility, ensuring they're as effective at the perimeter as they are under the basket. This level of analysis was unavailable to past players like Kareem, who relied mostly on traditional coaching and practice. The influence of positionless basketball. Another factor in this skill evolution is the rise of positionless basketball. In the past, each position came with distinct responsibilities. Centers and forwards stayed in the paint, while guards controlled the perimeter, but the modern game has shifted to a positionless approach. In today's NBA, every player, regardless of height, is expected to shoot, pass, and defend multiple positions. This style has encouraged taller players to develop skills that were once outside their traditional role. Now, seven-footers need to shoot from range, switch on defense, and even handle the ball, all skills they would never have developed in past eras. Why then are today's seven-foot players more skilled than ever before? It's a mix of advanced training, technology, and a shift in how basketball is played. Today's giants are learning skills from a young age that allow them to become not just centers, but complete, versatile players. Players like Wembenyama, Jokic, and Embiid are breaking the mold, proving that being a seven-footer is no longer just about height. It's about redefining what's possible on the court. If you enjoyed this look at the evolution of seven-foot players, hit the like button and subscribe for more insights into the changing world of sports. And let us know in the comments, who do you think is the most skilled seven-footer in the game right now?